afternoon amigos from Mexico City. Today is St. Patrick's Day and what better way to celebrate than at the Celtics, Celtics <laughs> pub. <laughs> Uh, a parade is about to start in 10 minutes, apparently, on this street. However, we haven't seen very many other people in green, but um, we're think... here for the parade. Now, if you're anything like me, which is dangerous, you might be, th you might be wondering or curious as to why they celebrate St. Pa Patrick's Day here in Mexico. You might be surprised by that fact, just as I was, but it is extremely important here. Uh, I'm gonna attempt to give a history here. Comment below, let me know what facts I missed out on though, because though inevitably something. But essentially during the Mexican-American War, there was a, a group of Irish immigrants and expats that defected from the U.S. Army, uh, essentially because they felt marginalized in the, uh, in the U.S. Army as, as Catholics and uh, potentially discriminated against. And so they defected from the U.S. Army down to Mexico and essentially switched sides and started uh, fighting for the Mexican Army against the U.S. Army in the Mexican-American War. Uh, so St. Patrick's Day is largely a military celebration here in Mexico cel celebrating the Batallón de San Patricio. So it's extremely interesting, Some, a story I'd never, never heard about before until I started doing some research about St. Patrick's Day here. But nonetheless, uh, despite the, the importance of this holiday, I, I'm still hoping there'll be some, some green beer, but we've got about five, 10 minutes till this parade's supposed to start. I think it, I think it starts ahorita. I think that's when it starts, ahorita. We've made it to the Irish pub. We found Dan from the new travel and Nars. We got our chips, the parade. Only 30 minutes late right now, so right on time, right on time. <laughs> Candy. <laughs> it's coming, amigos. I thought this was I thought this was German, amigos, not Irish. Let me know. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Freshman. Can you start dancing for us? Wow. Give us a jig. <laughs> I think we got a pretty good spot. <laughs> Makes it the best no, parade no, for you. Ireland. <laughs> oh, they're pretty dogs. Dan, when are you gonna when are you gonna start dancing, man? <laughs> That's pretty awesome. I would, I would end the parade. And like, that was like pretty that. good. Way better than I could do. Bill, are you itching to get out there to dance? I want to learn. <laughs> just just wing it, wing it. <laughs> What the heck was that? I'm stirring the pot. Yeah, 
pero vamos a, vamos a tomar cervezas verdes, amigos. ¿Cómo está tu cerveza, Dan? Oh, muy bien, muy bien. ¿Dónde está tu cerveza? How was it in there? So much green beer <laughs> with white pants. <laughs> Yeah. How was the parade compared to your expectations? The parade was actually a lot cooler. It was more traditional. They had several different backpack groups as well as like river river dancing. I don't know. Irish dancing. I will call it Irish dancing because I'm not sure if it might be different. But either way, it was very respectful and really cool. I skipped out on the green beer today. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dan and Ari are... They got me caught number seven. They can't, oh, come on. They, they can't finish their beers over here. It's taking them forever. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> now it's time for a good old Irish ski nap. <laughs> uh, I think I think closing thoughts are any any party, any holiday, uh I don't know, yeah, party, holiday, fiesta in Mexico. It's always such a blast, a good time. Yeah. Especially if it's fit for, for us gringos in the middle of the day. We don't have to stay up until 6 a.m. to make it happen. Yeah, I think it's really special to be a part of uh, celebrations that may be completely different than in your home country. I feel like it, it gives us a little more insight into the Mexican culture and how uh, Mexicans celebrate different holidays. Yeah, and even if, even if it's just... Uh, I mean, honestly, the, the actual way that we celebrated uh, here, at least in Condesa, I don't know how different that was than maybe how it would have been in Dallas, but I think just the fact that we were celebrating it here with Mexicans, con Mexicanos, felt, felt cool, felt... Uh, Qué chido, eh? eh? Muy chido. I think that's all we have for you guys today. So interesting, St. Patrick's Day here in Mexico City. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel. Click the bell to be notified. Cada vez. We have a new video. We are turning right. Oh. And we will see you. Manana. Bye bye. Good morning, amigos, and happy St. Patrick's Day! <laughs> We're here for a parade that's supposed to start in about 10 minutes. However, there's still cars on the street, so maybe a little late. <laughs> I thought we were good in our green shirts. Those people, they mean Irish business. Best news, we see the green, along with the trash truck. After all, the start to any good Irish parade is the sounds of Mexico City. We're gonna try to go in the Irish pub. We're not the only people.